Welcome to Lane Tour University. My name is Connor at Lane. Follow the video through. I actually forgot to mention this too. Also, the purpose of also having um, rat or rodent repellent, it keeps rats away, but you never know where your tour guests might go. They might take your car from wherever you're at and take it to another city or state or wherever they're at where there's a lot of rodents in the area. So to protect yourself and protect your car, spray your car with rodent repellent so that way no matter where your tour guest parks, they actually, um, the car will be less likely to be a safe haven or shelter for a rat or rodent. So spray so that no matter where your tour guest takes your cars, you don't know where they might go. Um, you don't want rats going into your car, chewing on the wires and having shelter and living in your car. So very, very important, spray that. But anyways, follow the video through to go deep. I just forgot to mention this part too. But anyways, I'm basically reiterating the same topic, but follow the video through. I'm um, gonna teach you how to actually protect your car from rodents. Welcome to Lane Troy University. My name's Conrad Lane. I have some great news for y'all. You guys might not have thought of this one. Did you know when your car is parked, I don't care how beautiful your area is or how not beautiful your area is, I don't care what area you're in, if it's a city, if it's a village, if it's a township, city, state, country, whatever, continent, wherever your car is parked at, typically there is wildlife. Doesn't matter if you're aware of that or not, especially at nighttime. When your car is parked, oftentimes, this is actually very common, you can actually uh, find out that rats, rodents, etc., crawl up into your a car engine. Uh, oftentimes they urinate on the um, engine and, and you can even see like their tracks. Oftentimes it's very, very common. Most people just aren't aware about it. I don't care how nice the car is or how great the area is. If there's trees or any type of vegetation or just in general, oftentimes these rodents will chew on wires and can actually damage your car. A way to get around this, first to be aware of it. Second, you can actually purchase um, rodent repellent to spray on your car engine, or car exterior, car battery. Uh, around your car just so it keeps helps increase the likelihood and chances of rodents staying away from your car because if they start chewing on your wires your car could prematurely be, be damaged and aged that way by them damaging and urinating it's just and also very disgusting but just in general but just want to let you all know about that so you can, if you go on google or even amazon you can actually purchase anything i'm not going to recommend any one um a specific brand it's up to you but just sharing another ideology to if you want to protect your car it's not about just making profits not just clean the exterior or clean the interior it's also about protecting and understanding that there are rodents at nighttime that try to find shelter uh and they actually go into, into your car also clean your car that should already be a must do anyway clean your car if you have a vacuum or whatever get up the debris get the crumbs because that also tracks rodents and insects etc and it's not a good experience it creates a smell and odor and it's just not a good look for uh, true guest when your car smells there's debris get it up people but especially even if your car's perfectly clean and it's parked rodents in general like to find shelter and they'll park on your uh the, the, sorry while your car's parked they'll go into your car that you, you you'll be surprised so very important spray rodent repellent love you guys like subscribe share uh follow me on instagram currently currently now peace